Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The government of Peru has greenlit a significant procurement initiative aimed at modernizing its military capabilities. With a budget allocation of $229.5 million, Peru intends to replace its outdated BM-21 grad launchers, which have been in service since the 1970s, with a new batch of multiple launch rocket systems, MLRS, and associated ammunition. This procurement initiative follows the acquisition of the first batch of 27 Type 90B MLRS from the Chinese manufacturer Norinco in 2013. However, the decision to procure the same model again is shrouded in uncertainty due to significant operational failures experienced with the existing Type 90B systems. The Peruvian army initially sought to incorporate a total of 40 MLRS launch units into its arsenal, but this purchase has been pending since 2013. Unofficial reports have circulated for years regarding the potential acquisition of the AR-3 MLRS system, boasting greater range and larger caliber, although this purchase never materialized. One of the primary concerns surrounding the existing Type 90B MLRS supplied by Norinco revolves around its poor quality and performance. Since its introduction, the specialized press has highlighted issues with the rockets provided by Norinco, as well as problems with the engines of the trucks serving as platforms for the Type 90B launchers. Additionally, during the military operation dubbed Patriota in mid-2022, reports emerged of tubes from the Type 90B launch modules exploding during firing sequences, posing significant risks to crew members. Unofficial sources suggest that the lack of chrome plating in the bore of these tubes contributes to their reduced lifespan. While the purchase price undoubtedly plays a role in procurement decisions, safety and performance are equally crucial considerations. The incident during Operation Patriota has prompted calls within the Peruvian government to reassess the choice of MLRS model. As Peru navigates its options in the international market, it must prioritize technical specifications that ensure both safety and performance. With numerous MLRS products available globally, the Peruvian army has a wide array of options to consider, each with its unique capabilities and features. The approval of this procurement initiative underscores Peru's commitment to modernizing its military infrastructure and enhancing its defense capabilities in alignment with evolving security challenges. However, the selection of a suitable MLRS system will be critical in ensuring operational effectiveness and safeguarding the lives of military personnel. That's all for now, see you later.